Radio Raheem here with Fred Cossey. You got a majority draw. A, a lot of people thought that Chris Ariel was going to come in here and be able to take his next step towards the heavyweight title shot. What did you do to stop him? And, and was it part of the game plan, or were you surprised that this fight went the way it did? No, people didn't see the wrong of me. Last time I, I said, like I said uh, yesterday, uh, my last fight I didn't get the proper rest. You know, I won in Pennsylvania. I couldn't sleep. And people didn't get a chance to see what I can do. But to now I show, you know, what I'm, you know, Fred, Big Fred is about, you know. Chris depended on power shots tonight. There was really no jab, no head movement, just walking in. Did that play into your game plan? And did you feel like fighting inside you were being, you were doing better than him? Or was fighting outside working better for you? No, actually, I take his jab away, you know, I, I know, you know, like, I, I, at time, I know the length of your reach. Figure out if you can make him miss a lot with his jab, you're going to forget about it, you know, like, that's why it plus. I know coming out, you're not going to know which way I'm coming to hit him, because I fight both ways. He didn't really know which way I was coming down. It was very really confusing to him. You said that you wanted people to know who you are. Uh, before we Before the fight, you told me that, Tonight, they're going to figure out what you can do. Now that they know who you are and what you can do, what's next for you? What do you feel like you earned tonight? I feel like I showed the world where I'm a better fighter. I'm be I belong to the heavyweight division. Uh, I'm, I'm ready to fight the best. You know, I, you know people didn't, don't, didn't know who Fred was back then. Now, tonight, I show what I can do. Radio Raheem with Fred Cossey pulling something of an upset draw here on CBS. Good job, man. Thank you. Well done.